practicing some days? Uh, I've been practicing a lot uh, these past couple of days. Uh, just getting back into it, getting back into the groove of things. Uh, and it's just been good. I mean, I can't wait for Monday. I'm ready to get out there and play with the Virginia Tech. Is it a relief to be able to recover so quickly and know that you're going to be available Monday? Um, I mean, it's a blessing. Uh, it could have been a lot worse. Uh, just glad that it, went, that it went how it went. Um, and I can say I'm just glad to be back out and I'm ready, I'm ready for Monday. What exactly happened? What was the injury? Um, I mean, I'd rather not discuss what actually happened, but I'm just glad to be back healthy. You know? Can't wait to be out there Monday. With, with the time off, well, I guess it was about a week or so, what were you able to do during that time to, to stay sharp? Uh, just dive into the playbook. I mean, we watch film a lot here, but just watching that extra film on my own, uh, having some meetings with the coaches, uh, getting deep into my playbook, uh, learning all the checks and things that we're going to do for game week. Uh, I mean, it actually helped me uh, just to sharpen up on some things because I wasn't able to actually be out there and practice. It helped me sharpen up my game mentally. From watching film, what do you think are some of the keys that are going to be slowing down Virginia Tech? Um, I mean, we got to play flat. We just got to play fast and physical. Uh, they play a lot of games with your eyes. Try to do a lot of little slick plays. Um, I mean, as long as we're disciplined, have our eyes in the right place, and playing fast and physical the whole game, we should have a problem. You made the transition to, to safety a little bit this throughout training camp. But do you think it's going to be any different for you when you actually play a game at that position? Uh, I mean, my father always told me, if you're a football player, you're a football player. Uh, I mean, it's not too far of a change. I mean, going from corner to safety, uh, it's just more space, more opportunity, I would say. Um, more action, too. But, I mean, it's just a bigger spotlight. I mean, you got to shine with the spotlight on. What do you like about that role? I mean, it's a safety role, but there are kind of some aspects of corner involved as well. Do you like kind of getting to play, like mix both skill sets? Yeah, I mean, it's kind of like putting two in one. Uh, it's like playing corner and playing safety at times because you do so much different things and you're so versatile in the position. I mean, I've had a great time playing it. I mean, I enjoyed it. Their quarterback, uh, I mean, he has the ability to run. Is he? Is that not usually his first option, though? Is he looking to throw more or, or can, what, mm -hmm. do you, what do you see? Uh, he's he's looking to run. Uh, he he's I think he's a competitor, and I think he likes the ball in his hands when it's crunch time. So when it's crunch time and they need those crucial yards, he's gonna keep the ball in his hands. Is it tough at all to prepare for a team that's had so many players coming in and out throughout the summer? Yeah, um, no, nah, I mean we have ways of, of finding film on guys who just came in into the system. I mean, just kind of. Being, being at Florida State, I mean, some of my teammates actually know some of the guys who transferred in to the school. So, I mean, just asking questions about them and then watching film from wherever they came from and then giving us a good feel for them.